Hello, it's Jennifer from Sea Lemon. I was recently contacted by Cricut and they asked if I would be interested in checking out their maker and doing an unboxing video. And this couldn't have come at a better time. It's such perfect timing because I have been thinking about getting a maker. I've been wanting to make my own stickers. I've been thinking of making a, a sticker Patreon tier. Now I can try it. Now I can try this machine and this video is going to be an unboxing kind of hang out with me. They sent me all these boxes and we're going to just see what is in here and check it out. You guys know I only make sponsored content with brands and products that I would actually use and I would think that you guys would be interested in. This video is sponsored by Cricut. Thank you very much Cricut. And if you want to check out all the stuff that's in here, I will put links in the video description below. Also, before we get into it, make sure you are subscribed to my channel and hit that bell icon so you can be the first to get notified for when I post new videos. We are almost to 1 million C subs, which is crazy. So join us and subscribe. So first I'm going to open the maker box. I don't know how they knew that I wanted to make my own stickers, but I am so happy they sent me all this stuff. I, I just, uh, <laughs> just so you guys know that I'm not going to be making stuff in this video. It's more of an unboxing hang out with me video, but um, I once I get familiar with it, I may make more videos using this stuff or just show you my process in my studio vlogs. I am not tall enough to, okay, give me, this is, I'm not tall enough, hold on. Put this down, Kona's looking at me like I'm crazy. Get this out of the box. <laughs> oh. Also, I want to mention I am new to the Cricut products, like everything. I've heard of Cricut and I've seen their products, but to be honest, I haven't tried any of them. And it looks like they've come a long way. Like the technology of them is crazy. This thing can cut almost anything and make anything. It's just, it's ridiculous. If any of you have tips or uh, want to share your experience in the comments, of using Cricut products. I would love to read your comments. So here's the box that comes on top. You can cut out interesting shapes that maybe are too difficult to cut out by hand or that are too expensive to get die cut from a printer. You can cut templates. They have a whole library of templates or you can make your own template and cut out your project with it. You can also kiss cut, which is like, you know when you get sticker sheets and the stickers come off while the background stays on the paper? That's a kiss cut. And you could do scoring. So they have a bunch of attachments that you can put on the machine and it will score your project for you. So your whole project could be automated with this machine rather than doing a bunch of it by hand. Okay, materials for your first project comes in a fancy black envelope. So we got these samples to test out. One of the attachments to the machine. Then we got a USB cable and a marker. This machine can draw out templates for you based on your template on a computer or the app, whatever you want it to draw out. The machine waiting inside the box, ready to be released into the world, the main plug. So this is the cutting mat that you have to put all your projects on. So the pink one is for fabric only, the blue one is for everything else. These do have an adhesive on them, so your paper or whatever material will stick to them. I believe always remain sticky, so that's how the machine cuts it so precisely, your project stays in place. Okay, now let's unwrap this machine, the maker. Ooh, sleek. Oh. I'm going to open the other boxes for now. Just put the mats right over here. Uh, we have a scoring wheel combo pack, true, a true control knife, premium steel. So it seems a little bit more 
premium than your regular craft knife. And the big thing in here is a bright pad. Sometimes when you cut intricate things, you have a lot of pieces left over to remove from the design so you can see them easier and get them off your project. Also, this can be used as a light table for tracing. So I'll have to try this out too. And some vinyl rolls in various colors and finishes. I've always seen rolls and swatches like this in the craft store, but I've never tried them because I've never had a Cricut thing to use them with. So I'm really excited to try these out. And there's also another knife blade, an easy press mat, which is for an easy press. And I believe the other box that they sent me is an easy press. And honestly, I didn't know they were going to send me that, so thank you. It makes iron-on vinyl really easy to apply to any of your projects. And from what I've read, it's a lot better to use than a traditional iron because there's no cool spots and it's consistent temperature all around, so it's better for your project. And this is the pad for it, so I'll have to try that out as well. There's some cardstock. Okay, great. I am all for cardstock. Use cardstock all the time. Two cardstock packs with 80 pound cover cardstock in them. Just so you know, I'm not going to test out the easy press, but I am going to open it because they sent it to me. Now we got the easy press two. This also has a little instruction envelope, fancy envelope. This is a test vinyl that it comes with. I will definitely be trying this thing out in the future. If you guys have any ideas or tips for using this for your iron-on projects, comment below. I'd love to read it. I hope you guys had fun hanging out with me today and unboxing this stuff. And again, thank you to Cricut for sending me all of this and sponsoring this video. I am seriously so excited to make stuff. And again, if you guys have any suggestions on projects, comment below. If you've tried any of this stuff, comment below. I think my first project is going to be some stickers and you can follow me on my Patreon for updates on stickers that will be available in a tier coming soon. I'll put that link in the description below along with all of the links to the stuff that I showed you today. Give this video a like and if you want to check out more art supply and unboxing type videos, check out this playlist right here and I will put a subscribe little icon button right here. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already and all of these links will be down below and I will see you guys in the next video.